say the win gave us confidence. We always had confidence. We always knew what we can do. It was just a, just a mentality of fighting back and never giving up. And when you, did, you got down by 14, how comfortable did you all feel? Did you all know you were going to make a comeback? We, we just kept fighting. Um, we, we didn't start fighting. I know that's the th theme of last week was the wit game, so whatever it takes, and we, we, made it, we made it happen. Hey, Jack, for the Alabama and South Carolina games, do you think this defense needed a break? You, just, an open date. you say that again? After these last two games and the offense you face, do you think you guys need a kind of a break to kind of catch your breath a little bit? Uh, I wouldn't say we need the break, but we got away from what we was doing early on in the season, getting people off the field on third down. We got away from that in the past two games. So we, this, this, off week, this off week came in at a good time. So we're going to get stuff correct and stuff like that, get everybody filled up. AJ, when you watch it on tape, do you – you think you guys look sluggish in any way? Do you look tired when you watch it on tape? Because you guys have played a ton of snaps, and it's not like there's a real rotation on the defensive side of the ball. Yeah, a couple guys banged up, so and there's a lot of communication, and guys banged up. Is it more physically wore down, or do you think mentally kind of toast? But you need a mental break. Uh, I wouldn't say mental break from the game. It's just we probably could have commu communicated better out there on the field than we did the past couple games, and guys banged up. AJ, when did you kind of get the uh, new addition to your hairstyle here? Uh, I did that Thursday night. What was the inspiration? Just oh, I was just, it just popped in my head, and I was like, I'm going to do orange too, and I did it. <laughs> <laughs> a little Halloween festive? Oh, uh, yeah, when I when I first got it, people were like, it's Halloween, it's Halloween, and shit. I'm like, I guess it was good timing <laughs> when I decided, so it all played out. How, how much confidence do you guys as a team have now with the offense to go to Stewart? That maybe the pressure's not on you guys to, you know, keep teams down. I know you still want to get off the field and play great defense, yeah. but is, can you relax a little bit because the offense is having some success? I want to say we sh we don't want to relax. We still want to be better than we was and pick up our game the most we can. But you know, Dog's been doing a tremendous job back there, but we just got to pick it up and help help the, help the offense more. You're a guy who loves to practice. Was today hard? You didn't get to do a lot. Uh, yeah, just getting my body right, treatment and stuff like that. So you weren't you weren't disappointed you didn't have to practice today? Yeah, um, I, I'm an older guy now, so I, I ain't gonna be like I want to go out and bang people at practice no more. I, I, I'd rather get my I'm want to be smart and get my body right and stuff. So I, I'm glad Coach Jones did that. He, he know he he know what he's doing with the team, so get us fresh and ready to go for the next. Next, next game against Kentucky. How what do you is guys the schedule? Keep it? I'm sorry, what is the schedule for you guys this week, the upperclassmen? I mean, are y'all going to be able to chill a little bit, like you said, be in the training room, or? Yeah, just pretty much working out, getting our bodies, getting our bodies right, treatment, go out, and then go out back on the field, then come back in and work out and stuff like that, and get treatment. Is, is it going to be hard to kind of keep the one game at a time approach? I mean, now you guys won this game. And Bold projections and people are talking about if you went out and where you might go and all this other stuff. Is it? it do you have to worry as a leader about maybe some of the young guys get caught up in that, or do you think this team's mentality is so grounded in one at a time that it's not an issue? I wouldn't say getting caught up in it. Everybody, everybody know that's the main goal, getting to a bowl game. But at the at the same time, you got to take take each week at a time. So we we do we take each one each week at a time and get that win. We're gonna get to a bowl game, but. We, we're going to go to a bowl game, so that's the last thing we worry about. We're going to make it to a bowl game. He thinks they got to you about Kentucky already? Well, we watch a lot. Of, we watch film on, on them today. I don't want to say anything like stick out. It's just they got they got to run the quarterback as well. and got a couple of formations, uh, run fits. You got to get fitted or they can gas you, but nothing, nothing, nothing crazy. You said South Carolina game film. It seemed like they really stressed the run to get themselves back into the game against South Carolina and, and rally back. What do you see out of their backs and the bad foot system they have? Oh, they, they got good backs. You know, they can make people miss strong and big, fast. You're coming off a win like that. How do you keep that momentum going this week through practice? How do you, how do you keep up that energy after coming off such an emotional run? Just, just a routine. Every week is routine. But we got an off week, so we're going to be able to – have more mental week, get our bodies on fresh and ready for Kentucky. Was that the craziest you've seen in the Tennessee locker room since you've been here? Yeah. <laughs> we had a dance off in the locker room. It's probably one it's, it's a great feeling.
you know, that's that. I told Coach earlier, it's just like, it feels good to win, but I was like, that's how it's supposed to feel. It, 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 is, it ain't nothing like, like it's, I'm used to like from going up to high school, just winning. So that's how, I told Coach, that's how it's supposed to feel. It feels like, feel normal. So that was a good feeling. AJ, Kurtz, Kurtz had a piece of, I don't know how many sacks he's had, but he's clearly making an impact for you guys defensively. Just kind of after what he's been through, and I know you're close to him, what does it mean? Kind of to you to see him having some success that he's had. Just I, I already knew he was gonna have success just by just by knowing, just working off from the off season and the spring ball and he getting his body back and healthy and stuff and like he had a huge play for us in the game this past week. Like shit, he got off that ball so fast, like everybody else was frozen while he was in in his motion and, and running. So he he, he dynamic player. He gonna make plays.